you lose the game 3-2, you know, you're headed to a lead start of the third period. One of those games you look back on and go, boy, I really hope we didn't let one slip away. Yeah, that's, that's an obvious answer. You know, uh, it still doesn't settle in. Uh, it's pretty frustrating. You know, we uh, we got some lucky bounces the first couple of periods to get that 2 nothing lead. Uh, tried to maintain pressure, and uh, unfortunately, we had a couple of breakdowns, and they uh, jumped on opportunities. One of the things that may have been a concern, at least was a concern for myself, I asked Coach about it in the pregame, was having 10 days off between games. You don't really have your game legs, even though you have good practices. Is that something that maybe caught up with you guys in the third period? Maybe the legs weren't quite there, and, and Utah was a little fresher having more games under the belt? You know, I don't know if it was legs or, uh, you know, uh, kind of mental mistakes. You know, you, you can take physical mistakes from time off like that, but when mental mistakes, uh, you know, that turn into physical mistakes cost you, uh, that, that's frustrating. And, Maybe that's part of the break, but uh, there's no excuses. You know, we got to put this one behind us and go forward. We got two more big games against them. Talk about the game time goal. He had the five ball and three. The guy comes out of the box to hit him with a pass, and away he goes in on Campbell. First of all, uh, from Campbell's perspective, I don't know if there's much he can do on a breakaway in a situation like that. And second of all, how much it is it maybe on you know, either him or the bench to kind of let everyone know when the icy guy's coming out of the box there? Yeah, you know, I, I, like I said, it's a breakdown. You know, uh, you can't fault one individual guy. I thought uh, I thought Jack played a phenomenal game. You know, three breakaways, three goals. I mean, that that's tough. There were a couple of screens actually on the last one. Um, you know, it, like I said, it's frustrating. Uh, really can't put words uh, to describe it. And you know, obviously there were breakdowns. We lost guys behind us, and they went in for breakaways. So, gotta move on. And then finally, right back at it tomorrow night. Is that the best medicine after a game like this? Oh yeah, no. Nope. Yeah, you, if you have this taste in your mouth, leave it in your mouth. And forget about when you jump on the ice, but. Uh, Somewhere in the back, you might get to remember it. Well, best of luck tomorrow night then, and we'll see you back on the ice. Nice.